So let it be a rabbit then, and I have a very good reference for my picture. Hello everyone, and welcome to the magical world of pyrography. Today I am burning a sweet bunny on a challenging piece of older wood. I must hide this darker middle part, so I would really appreciate it if you support me with your likes and subscribe to my channel. Let's go! As usual, I am marking the outlines with my spear pen and low heat. I want to make an important change here. On the reference photo, the rabbit's eyes are closed, but I want to open them and it changes also the texture of fur around the eye. When I am shading on a darker part of wood, I do not have to make too many dark values, because they are already there. But of course some values have to be almost black to create good contrast. I like burning fur texture with my spoon pen. For this, I just burn with one side. And I can honestly say that it took me really long time to learn how to use different angles of this pen for different textures.
So far so good. You cannot really tell where the wood is darker, at least where the rabbit is. After a lot of thinking, I have decided to just copy the background from the reference photo. I am making the values closer to the lighter parts of the rabbit very dark to bring the main figure more forward through high contrast. I do not want to read any horoscopes or predictions about this year of the rabbit. If something good is written there, I might be disappointed when something bad happens. But if there is something bad written, I will just get depressed. So it is better to take one day at a time and do my best. from, it is customarily to give toy animals from Chinese calendar to each other as a New Year present. But I do not come from China, so it usually happens on the 1st of January. And some people really pay close attention to the recommendations from magazines how to dress on the New Year's Eve to appease the animal and attract good luck for the whole year.
I create the texture of the floor with several simple lines. In the end, I draw some highlights with my white pen and white acrylics. And now the rabbit is finished! Look how much volume the picture has, and you cannot see at all that the wood has two colors. I really hope you've enjoyed this video. If so, please support me with your likes, subscribe, click the bell button not to miss my new videos. Leave me some comments too. And I will see you next time in my new pyrography journey. Send you a lot of inspiration. Bye!